everybody. Hi, it's me, Jane. It's so good to see you. It sure is, Jane. Merry Christmas, everybody. Isn't it exciting to know that Christmas is just right around the corner? Yes! And we're starting a new week of learning here in Omanitas. So, what time is it, Jane? I know it's circle time! That's right! Circle, circle, circle time, circle time, circle time! Yippee! Okay, so stop! Look, listen! Good morning, children! Good morning, teacher! How are you today, children? Fine, thank you, teacher! My name is Teacher Christy. What's your name? My name is Jane. And how old are you? Who's three years old? I'm three years old. Who's four years old? I'm four years old. Who's five years old? I'm five years old. Who's six years old? did great. Now it's time for our meditation, okay? So, Jane, why don't you go and sit with the rest of the kids? Yes, I love to do my meditation. Okay, we'll see you later. There she goes. Now, everyone, breathe in. Now, breathe out. And fold your hands, close your eyes, and think of this beautiful Christmas season full of love and joy and giving and happiness and being with our families and good health. And let's just let love and light fill our hearts. And let's be quiet for one minute. meditation? Sorry about the sneezing. Bless me. Okay. It's getting cold outside, isn't it? It's, ooh, I won't tell you what it is yet. How many days are in one week? Do you know? <gasps> seven. That's right. The days of the week are seven. The days of the week are seven. Monday one. Tuesday 2, Wednesday 3, Thursday 4, Friday 5, Saturday 6, and Sunday 7, Sunday 7. Yay! Okay, and how many months are in one year? Do you know? Twelve! That's right, because it takes the earth. Twelve months to go all away around the sun. It's like the earth is traveling, 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 and it comes back to the same place. And then one year goes by. Okay, so let's say the months together. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and December! Christmas time! That's the month we're in right now! It's so exciting! Okay, now, how many seasons are in one year? Four! That's right! There are four seasons that happen in a year. Spring, summer, autumn, winter, spring, Summer, autumn, winter. Can you tell me what season it is? Let's take a look. It's getting c -c cold. What season are we in? <gasps> winter! That's right. It's winter time. 
Should we say our winter poem? Here we go. One, two, three. Winter, winter, cold and ice. A mug of chocolate, hot chocolate, would be nice. Winter, winter, long and dark nights. Kids bundle up for snowball fights. Good job. Super good. Now, let's put on our Christmas songs. Are you ready? Here we go. Get your bells. Let's ring. Let's ring our bells. Let me turn it up a little bit. Jingle bell. Wait a minute. Stop a second. Let me turn it up a little. Let's have loud enough. All the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Hey, jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Yay, that's wonderful. Now, I'm going to wish, come on everyone, dance with me. We wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Now bring us a piggy pudding, now bring us a piggy pudding, now bring us a piggy pudding and bring it up here. Yay! Good job. Now close your eyes, close your eyes, close your eyes, open your eyes. Let's see our values. This was our value from last month. Be thankful. We've got a lot. We've got a lot. We've got a lot to be thankful for. Be a happy helper. Oh, be a happy helper. Show a sample love, a sample of real love. Be so Happy! H-A-P-P-Y We are happy, why not try a kiss, a smile throughout the day. Happiness is here to stay. Be cheerful no matter what's happening. The right thing is to obey. Do it now, right now. Do it now, right now. Everybody needs love. What everybody needs is love. What everybody needs is love. What everybody needs, what everybody needs, what everybody needs is love. Don't give up. If you're feeling a little down in the dumps, don't give up. Even if you're sick with the mumps, don't give up. Say please and Thank you. Super duper duper. Now close your eyes, close your eyes, close your eyes, open your eyes. Remember we were reading a story? This is Crew and Co. Do you remember Tristan and Grandpa Jake? There's Grandpa Jake and there's Tristan. And Grandpa Jake is teaching Tristan a lesson. Okay, and you remember, there's Mr. Oversight, and he wanted the crew to build something. And remember, they started grumbling and complaining. Let's see what happens next. <gasps> look. Uh-oh, do they look happy? Mm -mm. They look sad and grumpy. Dumpy D is back, Doug said. He didn't get any improvements made on him, like the rest of us did. No wonder he looks so grumpy. Grumpy is sad. We should probably get back to work, though, Road Roller suggested, unless we want him to get even grumpier. Well, I don't see why we need him, Doug said. We're capable on our own. Let him huff and puff all he wants. Huff and puff is like... Later that over afternoon, Mr. Oversight came to see how things were progressing. 
That means how things were going. Something's not right, he thought to himself. Many of the vehicles that he teamed up with were no longer working together. <gasps> oh, that is not good. Some of the vehicles look very unhappy. <gasps> They're not happy. There were arguments going on and the work had was not being done properly. <gasps> Oh my goodness, this is not good. He thought, we'll have to work something out or we'll never get this job done in time. Hello, Mr. Oversight, called a cheery voice. It was little Digger. Hi, Digger, said Mr. Oversight. I'm glad to see that someone is actually doing what I asked them to do. Do you have any idea what's going on? Not really, I've been busy working. Suddenly, there was a big crash. <gasps> Oh my goodness! Mr. Oversight and Little Digger turned to see what had happened. Look what you made me do! Crank shouted. One of the large steel poles had been Crank had been lifting had fallen out of his grasp and crashed heavily on the ground. Crash! Fortunately, he wasn't looking wasn't holding it too high, and it had not fallen on anyone. Don't blame me for your mistakes, Lori sh shouted back. That pole nearly hit me. And just think what, would have, what it would have done to my new paint job. Mr. Oversight had had enough. You see? Okay. Quiet, everyone, he said in the loudspeaker. The construction site was silent. I'm not at all happy with, with, with what is happening here today, he continued. And I, as I walked through the site, all I could hear was arguing, fighting, boasting, and other ugly talk. This is not the way to get a job done, is it? No one said anything. Could I say something, Little Digger asked? Of course, said Mr. Oversight. Little Digger is the only one who's been doing his job as he should, while the rest of you squabble. Squabble's like, squabble, squabble, fight, fight. And tomorrow we will see what happened next. But before we go, I want you to remember the moral, because we're talking about Christmas. Christmas is a time of love. Look at all the pretty hearts. Caring and helping others. When you celebrate Christmas, remember to think of others before yourself. And that's how you'll be the happiest. Okay, that's our circle time for today. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.